Hello, uh, this is Steve. I'm going to show you today how to record um, um, a pinball session played with Visual Pinball uh, for use with the pin to DMD at the editor later on. First, you have to copy a special uh, pin main DLL into the VPIN main installation ordner. And this I have done before, so there's nothing special about just download. Uh, the DLL from my website and copy it into the installation file, which I have done right now. Then create a directory uh, on the main drive C called TMP, which I've also done uh, before, and start playing Visual Pinball. Right now there is no dump file in it. And I will show you uh, just a, thought, a short session loading pinball table, playing some uh, seconds of uh, pinball to get an extraction from the uh, DMD image, and then load it in the pin to DMD editor. So I start playing right after. It should be enough. I will quit. And now, if you look in the directory again, you see there is a new file created dump txt. When you look into it, it's mainly uh, uh, zeros and later on ones representing the dots, uh, illuminated or not. So you can see the bit pattern here. And as this type of file can grow rather fast, we zip it afterwards with a single file compression to tool at gzip, and finally get um, a compre compressed file dump .txt.gz, which then can immediately be loaded in the pin to DMD uh, editor. So. Where is my editor? So it's in the download directory. Uh, here it is. So if we start the pin to DMD editor, we can write, um, go to the directory and load this animation. And you get just the animation we saw while playing uh, the game right now. Uh, from now on, uh, it's the same procedure to create keyframes and all that stuff. So, uh, that's it. I hope it helps. Another video tutorial from Steve using tools with P, Pin to DMD.